Hello and welcome to my Ultima 4 playthrough series, Quest of the Avatar. We're right here where we left off. It's been a little while if you're watching these live. Uh, so let's uh, take a look at the map and remind ourselves where we are. We are in Buccaneer's Den here, which if you look on the map, we are right here in the middle of the sea. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna slide on over to the Fens of the Dead. And the reason for that is, no, nope, magic is what I want, reagents. We have, we found Nightshade, I think the last time we played, but um, at the Fens of the Dead in the Bloody Plains where the ground is damp, so our poisonous swamps, we can uh, find uh, Mandrake. And the reason I really want Mandrake is for a couple of reasons. Number one, gate travel spell. I think that is going to be key. And the other thing is, well, I, I can already do Jinx because that's just Nightshade. I thought there was something else. The view command where we can like view the, the map. I'm curious about that one. It burns both a Nightshade and a Mandrake root. So uh, yeah, that's what I want to. That's what I want to do. Now let's take a quick peek at our stats, just to kind of see where everybody's at. Um, I don't think anybody's in place to level, um, at least not any of our high, higher level people. Um, yep, yeah, because you got to get the thirty two hundred for him. Uh, almost there. A couple hundred Niola will be ready for level seven. Um, got about 600 more points for Katrina, uh, about 400 for Dupree, just, uh, you know, a couple hundred for Joffrey. So we have a few people. Shabano is level six, so he's got to get the 3200, so he's got like 900 points to go. Uh, Janet's pretty darn close, I think, because she's level two. Yeah, so she's got to get to 200, so she's only 25 points away, so she could... Which I expected. You know, she's been uh, with us the least amount of time. Um, so, and let's look at what we have here. We've got, you know, we got about, we got 55 Nightshade. And we've got, how many cure spells do we have? We have zero cure spells. Okay, that's a problem. That's a problem because we're going to be uh, in the swamps and people are going to get poisoned. So I think before we get too much further along here, if I thought about it, I would have done this ahead of time, but I did not. So we need to mix reagents for spell C. And cure takes garlic and ginseng. So that's C and B. And now we have a cure. And we're just going to continue and do that a few times here. Okay, so there we are. We are at 10. Um, I could do more, but our, our reagents aren't necessarily... Um, we, might need, we might need a few more of those. Um, so that gives us you know, enough to cure everybody once and, uh, and have a couple extra left over. I mean, John is probably the one I'm really going to be worried about if we get poisoned or... Uh, almost it should say when because we're going to be in the swamp land there but uh let's see so first we we need to we got some bad guys here you'll see we have some nixies off to the left and we got a pirate ship down there in the south so let's get into some combat and do a little stabby stabby and somebody joffrey it's shamino has got the magic bow and so most of us are going to have to try to do melee, and then hopefully Shamino can back us up like that with the bow. Perfect. All right, I'm going to come over here. You can stay put. You can go up. Over. You can stay put. Come over. I'm going to have Shamino help them out. I'm not certain that those Nixies can actually get to us. Well, no, they can, they can swim in the shallows. They can swim in the shallows. What am I thinking? All right, I can come over here. And you can go up there. So now we're kind of ringing, ringing the, the inlet here, daring them 
to come at us. All right. But if they're going to continue to be one shots like that, then that'll be a good deal. All right. Come on, Iolo. Oh, good. Good job. Good job. Good job. All right. Um, I think most of you are out of it. I might be able to get Shamino over there, but more than likely, I'm just going to have to go up and take this fool out. My own darn self. Okay. Ooh. Oh, he's fleeing. Oh, there's still Nixie by Iolo. I thought that was a. I thought he killed him. I just. I get. I. I, I kind of lost. And, and my Nixie is fleeing. Oh, really, Iolo? Come on. He can't have that much health left. And this guy, I'm actually going to move out of the way. There's no reason for me. Well, I mean, I could fireball his butt, but I'm going to see if I can get Shamino over there. And I think I just screwed up Iolo, him getting attacked this round. All right. Come on, Iolo. Finish this guy off. Dear God. <laughs> I guess I'm going to come down. have to come down and help him. All right, Shamino. I'm coming down. There we go. Oh, that guy's like, he doesn't want to get hit with our magic bow. How about our spear magic helmet? Not that we have that. Well, we have mystic robes on. I don't know if that counts. Not really a spear, but you know. It's going for the reference. Got him. All right, cool. We got five experience points. So let's see if we can, I want to see if I can, no, come on. I want to take this, yeah, all right. Oh, one guy. I wanted to take this guy on before, you know, I didn't want to take him on in the boat. I'm just feeling super duper skittish about fighting in the boat. And so I just wanted to be able to take him out, take him out, take him out, take him out. And that's perfect. So we have another boat <laughs> here in a place where we'll probably never, ever be able to utilize that for anything because there's no gate here. We're in the middle of the, of the sea. Let's go back to the map and look at coordinates. So we are roughly at J and I, and we need to get to like, J, K, and F. So we, we just literally have to get around the island here and then we have to go um, due west. So that should be simple enough, he says. All right, let's board our ship. Let's come down here. And, west we, and of course, the wind is from the west right now. And so Nixies are going to plague our butts. Ooh, a fairly big group too. All right. I guess we got to get people at the openings. And then the people in the middle are just SOL, except for Shamino. He can do some good with his bow. Oh, that guy actually had some armor or something. All right. Oh, that was a good shot, Katrina. Nice job. Dupree, Shamino, Shamino. Uh, uh, Iolo, come on. I need to get him you know, like some basic. Sword, swordsmanship classes, or maybe the problem is just you know, I, I've always had the feeling that Iolo is older. Maybe he just needs some glasses. You know, maybe that's maybe that's the problem. He just needs his 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 eyesight adjusted a little bit. All right. 
All right, that's good. All right, we're down to one, I think. I'm gonna bring Shamino over in case he can help. Dupree might take care of this guy before, or he might dismiss. All right, let's go. Let's keep going. Let's keep rolling. Come on, Dupree. Ah, oh, Dupree, you're killing me. You got one more shot at it, and then, uh, you know, uh, Shamino's going to turn him into a pin cushion. Come on, Shamino. Oh, dear God. There we go. Wow, that took a long time. All right, we will continue west at our snail's pace. All right, the wind changed. And here we are, the Fens of the Dead. I want to get close to the shore, if at all possible. In fact, on the shore is better. And, like, this is perfect. Because that way, if somebody wants to come and shoot up the ship, we're on the shore. Okay, so here's the basic deal. Um... Yeah, like we got more Nixies coming. Well, nah, not that I'm worried about Nixies. So um, Mandrake is available during the full moon phases here. So we're gonna wait a bit uh, for it to get for it to get to be full moon, um, which shouldn't take very long here. And then we'll. It's just uh, you know, it's it's like with the nightshade. We'll get on the uh, get on the um, the stuff there, and we will search. And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll build up a supply of nightshade. Now, I'm hoping that by not necessarily standing on there, but by hopping on and off, we might limit how much uh, poisoning that takes place. But we will have to see how that's going to go. Okay, so let's search. Nothing there. So we got nothing that time. And three of us got poisoned. Holy Hannah. You know, I don't think I'm going to move. Because... Every movement is a chance to die or to get poisoned. So who's poisoned? Me and Iolo and Dupree. Okay, I'm okay. We got a lot of health. We got a lot of health here. So let's just keep going and see if we can get some Mandrake here. I'm kind of wondering if I need to get up. I mean, this is... Oh, I don't know if I need to be on the island. Um, in which case... If that's the case, then maybe we'll get up to like onto that one where the Nixie's at. We can actually use the boat to uh, kind of span that that gap there. But let's see how this is going to go. And we'll live with being poisoned for a while, except for Jana. If she gets poisoned, I'll probably have to cure her, just because she doesn't have very much in the way of health. And these Nixies are going to come down here pretty quick and fight us. So that'll be a distraction. And they'll probably muck up our timing with the moons. Because that's what Nixies do. I would like to at least be able to search once before we have to fight these yo-yos. Nothing there. All right. When we get done with this battle, we're going to get back in the ship and we're going to move up and get on the island. Because I think the islands are actually the Fens of the Dead and not the mainland, even though there is, um, even though there is, uh, you know, actual swamp area there. So let's try that. Because the last, I did try this once before and uh, I, I parked in a stupid place and a ship came by and blew me out of the water and we died and I was like, Nope, I'm not accepting that. So yeah, I reject your reality. And uh, I was like, no, I'm not. We're not. We're not doing that. I'm not into the whole death and you lost all your money stuff. No, 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 no. So I, uh, I said no, thank you, <laughs> and I um, moved on and 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 decided to come back another day. And today is that day. But I do know that. Every now and then you'd get one where you didn't find anything on a search, but it was, for the most part, you know, I, I feel like I got one, you know, like, 
I don't know, four out of every five searches, maybe? And of course, that's not to say that that's going to work for us today, but... I still kind of feel like we need... Oh, I screwed that up. I, I still kind of feel like we need to be on the... On the island. All right, come on, little seahorse or whatever the heck you are. All right. Uh, sh oh, Shamino. I'll have him come over. You come over there. This seahorse is just having a good old time. Hit me with magical hits. Um, when I can't hit it. Oh dear God, guys, come on. And now it wants to come in and have a piece of me. All right, well, you're next. You're next. All right. All right, we're just down to the seahorse. I don't think Shamino is going to be in position to do anything before because I probably won't have to hit the seahorse too much. Yeah, okay. I apologize for all of the... Oh, Janna's poison. All right. I'm going to cure her. Come on. Oh, come on. It shouldn't take... Even against the wind, it shouldn't take... Four key presses. All right. I'm going to cure Janna. And then I'm going to heal Janna. Get her full 200. I'm not worried about any of the rest of us. We're doing okay. All right, so let's let the moons get to double dark again. And see if we can get ourselves some Mandrake. All right, this isn't working. <laughs> I'm gonna give it one more cycle here and we'll see what's happening. See if we get some. I don't think we've gotten any. Um, whoops. Let's just double check. Yes, we have not gotten any yet. We have not gotten any yet. Okay, so I've done about two or three cycles now of the moons, and every time is nothing here. So this must not be the right island. I'm going to have to go to one of these outer islands and, and hope that... Um... All right, so we got to fight these yo-yos. I'm not super-duper worried about this. Um, we'll just get him Shamino. we got to get into some sort of attack position. I think we'll just let them come at us. And hopefully maybe Shamino can get them from a distance. Uh, not when he does that crap. All right, you're going to stay put. You're going to stay put. You come over. All right, come on, Jenna. Or Julia, excuse me, Julia. Julie, Julia. All right, there we go. That's one down, two down. He's fleeing. So that probably means our gold is safe. Interesting, he's fleeing toward us. Never a smart move. <laughs> All things considered. Um, you know what? I'm going to leave that there for right now. Uh, 
I think that's the third time I have um, cured Jana. All right, let's get out of here. The good news is if we can find, um, like even if something comes along, a pirate ship comes along and it destroys our ship right now, we can, we'll be able to gate travel. So we won't be stuck on this stupid little island for the rest of our natural lives. Um, that's the good news. Okay, we did get some health back. That's good. All right, where are we at with the moons? We're a ways for the moon. So let's, uh, I'll bring you back once we're doing a little searching and hopefully we're going to have some better luck at this island. And here we go. We finally found some mandrake root. All right. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's see. Gonna cure Jana again. Uh, let's take a look and see how much we got. Oh, I'm hoping it's like the, um, we got seven mandrake just with that. All right, good. Um, it, it turns out there's like two really specific points where you have to be. I was trying different points in these islands and finally I had to break down and look it up. And, um, I was told that I had to be here. It had to be here. Um, you know, so it is what it is. Uh, so I'm just going to stay here for a bit and do a little, do a little, uh, grinding and hopefully get a nice supply and then we'll go from there. Well, as you can see, we've got some dragons that want to come and have some fun. And a Balron. Lovely. All right, so. Let's take these guys out. I really like it if the Balron wanted to get up close and personal here. Where are you at, Shamino? Let's get you over there. And I'm going to come over here. You can stay put. You can stay put. Then over there, you go up. You can stay put. Barely wounded. A lot to go there. If I can get a good lineup on the Balron, I might uh, shoot some fireballs into his face. Just because I don't want to deal with the whole putting everybody to sleep. BS. Lightly wounded. These dragons have got uh, some tough hides. I'm going to ignore you, Mr. Dragon. How do you like that? You and your roller skate feet. I know they're supposed to be bloody talons, but they look like roller skates to me. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> Still lightly wounded. Dang. All right. Get ready for a fireball in your face, Mr. Balron. That dragon's fleeing. We have still haven't got a super good hit on this guy. And still don't. Cast. Fireball north. Lightly wounded. Holy hell. Okay. You can't do anything. Come on, Iolo. Nice. One hit shot there. I like that. Unlike this guy here. He's finally up to heavily wounded. That has taken long enough. All right. Now he's heavily wounded, the Balron is. If he'll come closer to me, I'll start going melee. But as long as he's at a distance... I might invest one more fireball in his face. There we go, gone. Perfect. Perfect. All right, we finally got rid of that guy. He 
He's heavily wounded already. All right, come on, guys. Have at you. I'm not. Oh, come on, Shamino. Get your Katniss on or your Hawkeye, you know, whichever archery hero you want to emulate. Do it to it. Okay, we're down to two. Come on. I'm going to try to get Shamino up where he can at least hit this guy. This is in the little bay-like area. I might have to fireball this guy that I've got a line on just because he doesn't seem inclined to come to me. He's critical. All right. So probably only one more hit would do him in. I'd hate to have to have that be a fireball, but I guess if I got to do it, I got to do it. All right, he's gone. All right, Shamino. Barely wounded. Right, I'm going to come down. You're going to get down. I'm going to come down. Unless Shamino can deal with this guy with the bow before I get in place. He's still only lightly wounded. So I'm probably going to have to fireball him. I don't remember these guys being quite this tough. Now he's heavily wounded. All right. Everybody's dead. Good. Um. Oh, let's see. That's like the fourth time I've had to, to cure Janna. Um, and she just got poisoned again. Holy hell. All right, let's take a look at the stats real fast. Um, see how much we got. So, um, whoops, back up. We got 21 Mandrake. That's not too bad. Uh, I would like a little bit more, but I'm not going to worry about that for today. Uh, I might come back. I might grind on this a little bit uh, off off cam and just try to get more. I'd like to get like 50 or so. That'd be awesome. But I, I went through about five cycles and I got Mandrake on about three of them. And apparently this is the only little square I can be standing in for the um fens of the for the fens of the dead um i think the other one is for up in the bloody plains which is what we were our our our, our, our hint set so i i came to this spot on that one where i just quit because i died uh and i just i guess i just lucked out because that's just like where i went and that was i stepped out and found mandrake so i guess i was just supremely lucky last time but I'm going to let that be that. I'll be back with another episode soon. And we'll continue on from here. And maybe we'll play around with the gate travel spell. And plus, I just discovered the secret of the wheel. And that is something that we need. So that's probably what we're going to be doing next time. So until then, be seeing you. <laughs>